it's Michelle and I've got a cute little table setting idea for you today. We're going to be doing a Mickey and Minnie table setting. Recently when I was in the Dollar General store I saw these napkins in the red with the white polka dots and of course the first thing that I thought of was Minnie Mouse and they were even on clearance. This is usually a dollar a pack but they were on clearance for 75 cents. This is the small beverage size and we're going to be doing our place setting today with the little dessert plates. We're going to be using the larger ones for something else. I'll show you that when we get to it but if you wanted to you could do a larger table setting. Um, they did not have these in the larger size at Dollar General but I did see some red with white polka dots in the larger size at Walmart. So whatever you all want to do, but I'm going to be doing the smaller size today. And one reason for that is because of the size that I need for the ears. I've got a very large punch here. This is a circle punch that makes a two and a half inch circle. And that's what I'm going to be using my larger plate for. I'm going to use that circle punch to punch out some pieces out of the larger plate for the ears. I'm just going to cut the rim off of my plate so I can get that in my punch. I know this may seem like a waste, but these are just the little $1 plates and I figured that way it would be the same color, the same gloss, and the same texture to match with my plate. If you didn't want to do that, you could use black cardstock or whatever you wanted to use to make the ears. We're just going to punch out a couple of circles. Kind of miss the edge on that one but that's okay that's not going to matter you'll see why okay the next thing we're going to do is bring in our hot glue gun and I'm using low temp and we're just going to glue these on as our ears okay so we're just going to glue one on first one doesn't really matter where just glue it under that edge. We'll get that excess off when it dries. Okay, and then we're going to try to find placement for our other ear. And that's why our little missed edge doesn't matter too much. We'll just put that part behind the plate so it won't show. And there is your Minnie Mouse plate. And then that if you want to just leave it like that, that is your Mickey Mouse plate. You can just leave those like that, or you can take your red and white polka dot napkins, and we're just going to fold that into a bow tie. We're just going to Fold that straight in half. 
You don't have to fold it in half. You can just start from the edge. But as you all know, I like to fold it in the middle first so that I know it's going to be even. I shouldn't have creased that all the way out. Sorry about that. We just want to crease in the middle, just right here. And then do about half inch accordion folds. Crease in, in the middle. And then flip it over to the other half. Okay. And then I'm just going to bring in one of my red elastics that I got from the dollar store in the hair accessory aisle. Put that on there to hold our bow tie together. We place that at the top. And that turns Mickey Mouse into Minnie Mouse. You all let me know what you think. Don't forget to subscribe. Give me a like on Facebook and follow me on Pinterest. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.